We're here at Skull Creek Boathouse, a great restaurant for seafood by the water. And we're going to check it out. We've been here a few times before. Um, getting here before the crowds get here. So it's about 4 30. We're going to take an early dinner. Shows you how far everything is from Skull Creek. The Key West, Havana, Buenos Aires, Hong Kong. <laughs> That's the gift store over here, general store. Looks like they've been moving the boats around here in the marina. They're going inside. So this is the inside, and it's extremely cool in here, which is great compared to outside. Even on the porch, they have a side porch area. It's really nicely themed inside. And there's the porch there. It's actually about 10 degrees hotter. And then beyond that is the outside bar over there. And you also eat outside the whole eating area. And we decided to go, for two people, we're just going to get the fried, right there, the fried um, Fisherman's Feast for 26 So we're going to get that um, for our meal. It's kind of a pick and choose. So we're getting that. So we ordered the garden salad. And it's it's pretty good sized garden salad. Not just a regular side salad. It's huge. So our uh, fisherman's catch came pretty quick. So this is the uh, plate that you get. You can always add extra to it. They have different uh, other fried food that you can add to it. We pretty much get the standard. So looks good. So we're going to dig into it in just a minute. We're still eating our salad. They were pretty quick about it. So I am happy about that. You don't have to wait too long for your food. So we really enjoyed the seafood platter that we had. I would have to say um, probably one of my better seafood dishes since we've been here was here at um, Skull Creek uh, Boathouse. I love the, the batter is just right too. It's not too overdone, not too overcooked. They just put the right amount of batter on their um, fish, and their shrimp, scallops, and the oysters. Very good dish. I'd highly recommend it. Um, they also, if you look above there, they have a sushi bar here too. So they do su serve sushi. They've got sake as well. Uh, they have oyster bar, raw oysters. And, um, and I do highly recommend to come here when you're here in Hilton Head. Um, right now it's down pouring outside just the rain is torrential and that's the thing about the weather here too you can have a downpour for 15 minutes and sun come right back out so get you right on the literally right on the beach and in intercoastal waterway you see the gray white shark over there it's pretty cool he says hello to you when you come in And here's the outside of uh, Skull Creek Boathouse Restaurant. And they have live music here too. And like I said, it was it was raining like crazy earlier. So, um, yeah, everybody kind of vacated the area once that rain came in. But they have live music here too. And you can see the clouds back there in the back. Yeah, it was coming down. Cats and dogs. It's crazy. And you gotta love this sign over here. As you walk out towards the pier, right there, beware of alligators. So, we will definitely keep our eye out. Walk out here real quick so we get a view. 
I don't see any alligator right now. The weather here, I mean, it changes very quickly. You can have a downpour, and that was the system that went through over there. And then 15 minutes later, boom, it's back to this. Uh, Hudson Restaurant is next door. It's another awesome restaurant. So, great area to eat out. Enjoy the uh, sunset, too. And the boat's going by. So also we're going to check out the uh, Skull Creek Boathouse uh, souvenir store too. They have really cool t-shirts in there. Heat comes right back too pretty quick. Uh, and there's your longitude and latitude of the area here where we're located. <clears throat> And that's the Hudson over there restaurant and that right next door we had like a we enjoy coming here all the time so we've never had a bad meal here uh, for dessert I had the uh, peanut butter chocolate cake and Connie had the pecan caramel cheesecake it's a praline yeah and caramel So go, we'll go check out the store too and see what they have uh, t-shirt wise and other souvenirs. Check out the uh, refrigerator magnets. I like this one here. Also the bottle cap, I like that too. <laughs> cool stuff. Kinds of different cups, co uh, koozies, stuff like that, and little shot glasses. Different soaps. Of course, Connie will get the soaps. Get the bottle openers. Wizard of Oz characters like the ducks. You put them in your pool, bathtub. I think they light up too. Marin Row. Of course, anything dog related, I don't know, like that too. So it's like benefits the uh, Hilton Head Humane Society when you buy a t shirt. Awesome. Anything for the dogs, of course, and the cats. Kind of, you see this over here? The, it benefits the um, Hilton Head Humane Society when you buy the shirt. You get all different colors. We'll check out upstairs too and see what they have up there. A lot of times they have their clearance stuff upstairs, so when you're in town, you come here, make sure you check out upstairs. All kinds of different ball caps that you can choose from, different colors. And it's pretty much like the attic here. All kinds of cool designs with the t shirts. You know, when I work at Threads, when we. Um, might find something here. Take home. Like this one here. 